starting off by wetting my hair. I personally load my hair with a lot of products as you see in this video so it's really imperative that I go in first and just massage my scalp to get all that excess build off off so I can make sure that my scalp is actually clean to receive the shampoo. So I'm starting off with shampooing my hair. I actually shampoo only once so I don't lather, rinse, and repeat. I just lather. Um, I find that shampoos are really drying and even with a good conditioner like the bo 5 one I have, it still leaves your hair with little to no moisture. So I just like to lather and then rinse it out. conditioners I really just stick with the bo 5 because it's cheap and your girl is a college student I am three years natural I actually celebrated that in August my total wash time on a good day is 30 to 45 minutes but sometimes it's an hour so I do like to hold my conditioner in just for a little bit longer so I actually rinse it out outside of the shower. Now if you guys have seen my video before on introducing Shea by Nay, you'll know that this is the Shea by Nay line. I use her conditioners very heavily. Unfortunately, I have actually run out. So if anybody has any deep conditioners they want to introduce to me, just definitely drop them in the comment section. But these are definitely great. And as soon as she reloads the line, I'm going to get some more. So what does your girl do on her wash day? Your girl likes to watch YouTube and eat vegetarian food. On this day, I think I was having sweet potatoes, rice, and pasta. Right here, I'm just drying my hair after rinsing out the deep conditioner. Now I'm about to start with my LOC method, which starts with your leave-in conditioner. Hey, girl! So if you guys saw my super defined twist out video, I used the same products in there, but I didn't show you guys the application before. I just twisted it up. So I wanted to let you guys know how my hair looks while putting these products in. <laughs> Uh, these products give me great slip. I definitely am a fan of Cantu Shea Butter. So I start off with the leave-in conditioner. That's your L. And I apply that on my hair. My hair is still fairly wet. It takes really, really long for my hair to dry. So my hair stays wet forever. Um... <laughs> And then I just distribute that through my hair and I finger the tangle as well so I can just, you know, cut down on combing. And as the title suggests, you know, I come in real quick with that curling cream. You know, and this actually really enhances my curls more while the leave-in conditioner just puts the moisture back in. The curling cream gives you that pop, pop, pop. But, you know, you got to seal it with the olive oil. <laughs> you got to seal your hair with olive oil. It's a major step, guys. If you're not sealing your hair, then really your moisture just leaves. And that's why your hair will be dry within two days. Now, sealing my hair with oil definitely helps it stay moisturized. You can even see it in the video that the side with nothing on there is dead. <laughs> it's not even really bouncing compared to the other one. What's the other side do? Nothing. Dead. Uh, guys, definitely get you a LOC method. You can also do LCO. That's what I do. Um, it's different methods, really. It's just some type of moisturizing, sealing method that keeps your strands healthy. So like I said, if you saw my super defined twist out video, you know what is coming up next. Your girl's about to do a twist out real quick, one time for the one time. 
definitely have a good amount of slip compared to if I just comb my hair straight out the shower, your girl will be bald headed. And we don't want that. Here are my twists, and right now I'm just taking them out just so I can show you guys the volume that I get. I actually don't take my twist out the next day. Like most naturalistas, I don't like first day hair. So I just pull it back in a bun and I just let it dry until it's really stretched out and I get this look. Thank you so much for checking out this video. It really means a lot. Um, I hope these tips help you guys. If you guys have any suggestions for me on, I don't know, maybe stretching my hair or some products that you think would be good. Or if you have any comments or questions. If you have any comments or questions, please feel free to do that in the comment section below. Thank you for checking out this video. And I will see you all very soon. Any comments or questions? Boom. Boom.